meat, brownies, and granola? What is going on? Some of you may be familiar with pemmican. It's a traditional Native American food that's created by drying beef and rendering beef fat, combining those two things together, and you essentially have a beef brownie of some sort. Sometimes the Native Americans added berries to the pemmican uh, to make it more palatable uh, to European travelers. And pemmican being made of this dried beef fat and tallow, two products that don't go bad, is non-perishable. It is the ultimate travel food, calorically dense and a complete source of nutrition. It never goes bad. So here at Frankie's Free Range Meat, we have come up with a preparation technique and a recipe that makes this pemmican taste like candy. And there is nothing better to describe it than a beef brownie. So we're gonna take a look at that as well as something my business partner Adam came up with. And it, the names he came up with this were pretty terrible. I'm gonna call it Meat Granola for now. Uh, he came up with Meat Nola uh, Tail Mix as well as uh, some other, you know, if you guys have any ideas for Meat Granola, Carnivore Granola, let me know down in the comments below. But this granola is 95% beef, yet it doesn't really taste like beef. It has beef in it, as well as berries, coconut flakes, macadamia nuts, and a little bit of honey, as well as salt. And this stuff is like cereal. You could put this beef in raw milk and eat it for breakfast. It is so delicious and approachable and palatable, yet the majority of it is beef. So first, let's take a look at our brownie and taste it and let you guys know how it is. Here is our brownie. This is three ounces and believe it or not, 700 calories. Do you know anything else this small packed with so many calories? You eat two or three of these, you don't need to eat anything else for the day. Uh, some of you have already ordered our pemmican and we are shipping all of it out this week. Our previous pemmican was a smaller size. It was one ounce. Uh, so we've increased the size of the bar and we've always offered three flavors. Traditional pemmican made with just beef, no salt. We have salted pemmican made with beef and salt. And this is our tasty pemmican, which has blueberries, honey, as well as salt. And the majority of the calories are still from beef, upwards of 98% of them. It's just, this is much more palatable and delicious and enjoyable. And this is the version of it I prefer to consume. So if you guys do have a more restrictive diet, you can get uh, plain versions of this. And the texture is just so amazing. But this tasty version, guys, this will blow your mind when you try it. So th this stuff is so soft. It's literally, you know, melting in my hand as I'm holding it. And I had this in the fridge uh, just to firm it up a little bit. Uh, but we're going to take a bite. This is crazy. This is absolutely insane. It's like, it just melts in your mouth. It's so soft. And it has like every flavor. It's like, it's slightly sweet. It's really savory, you have the saltiness. I would get so fat eating these. I try not to leave any of these at my house because I will just end up eating all of them and becoming the chubby little Italian boy that I am destined to be. But this pemmican is so delicious and amazing. If you guys need a travel food, if you guys need a snack food, something you can eat, uh, that doesn't have to be prepped. This is perfect. But let's take a look 
at the meat granola. Because this stuff has been blowing my mind. So it comes in a bag. And as I said, we have, you know, we have coconut flakes. We have macadamia nuts, blueberries. But 95% of it is beef. And that's from a caloric standpoint. And when you eat this, you're like, what is going on? It's like you're eating beef, but it tastes like granola. This doesn't make any sense. I know I said we have options for the pemmican in regards to flavors, but in the granola, we only have one flavor because without the coconut, without all these other ingredients, the combination and the ratio that we've created, it doesn't, it doesn't work. You need to have all of the ingredients in this for it to be this good. I gotta keep this stuff out of my house too because I'm gonna eat the whole bag. And some of you guys might be wondering, Frank, I thought you never eat plant foods. And the last time I had plant foods it was probably the last time I tried my pemmican in a video, which was a couple months back. That's where I had the blueberry pemmican. But this stuff is just so good and it's made with high quality ingredients. The flavor and texture of the pemmican was very delicious, but it was rich, calorie dense, uh, soft, and creamy. This is much crunchier. I would say this is more something that is approachable and similar to a food people have had before. The beef is so dehydrated that it adds a crunchiness throughout the whole time you're eating it. The coconut flake adds that granola flavor that people are familiar with. You bite into the blueberry, you get a little bit of chewiness, and the macadamia nut has like obviously a very nutty flavor, very complex flavor and more crunchiness. It replicates the flavor and texture of granola very well, but it's good for you because it's meat. I've been standing here for like 10 minutes eating this and I'm gonna stop myself. I'm almost done with the bag. So uh, definitely way too tasty for its own good. As I said, if you already ordered pemmican, we will be shipping it out this week. If you guys are interested in these products, they are available today on frankiesfreerangemeat.com under the names pemmican and meat granola. So if you guys want high quality, nutrient dense animal foods that are non-perishable, great for traveling and delicious, definitely check it out. And this is just a glimpse of what we are looking to do in the future. I've spoken a lot about our creativity and ideas and things we are going to do. This is none of that. We have so many more ideas and things that will blow your mind even more uh, that we're going to do once we have a larger facility, more production. And these all fall in line with items that are focused on meat. And some of them will have plant additives to make them slightly more approachable. And this is also not just limited to these types of products. You know, as I've mentioned many times, uh, we want to do things like raw dairy, uh, soy free, corn free eggs, get you guys the highest quality animal foods in all realms possible. And with your continued support and purchasing what we have available now, and we have everything that everyone else has available and more, you know, grass fed beef, fat, organs, caviar, raw cheeses, we have all that stuff, but we really want to take it uh, beyond what anyone else has done right now, uh, especially for online meat retailers. So again, check out frankiesfreerangemeat.com and see what products we have to offer. If you guys could please like the video, subscribe, hit that bell icon, and share it if you can. You guys enjoy the rest of your day.